Uh, Sean McConnell, since 74. You'll have to do the math. I'm not sure. I don't know, 30-something. Highlights, just places and people I've met. Um, just racing, really. I, I mean, I've got to meet a lot of people, do a lot of fun things for a lot, long, long time. You know, I've won some fairly important races, never been national champion, but um, had a good time all the way. Well, the bikes got extremely fast and expensive through the years. You know, that's probably the biggest thing. You know, the lay-down motor with the, uh, the leading link front end, which is a good thing. I, I really like the leading link. I would just like to keep the old uprights. I think the, the racing was closer and a lot cheaper in those days. Um, out of the new riders, who impresses you of the kids that are coming up? Holy cow, there's so many right now. I mean, the young kid, I mean, we got a, a group of juniors, you know. there's. I don't want to mention names because I don't want to single anyone, miss anyone really, but we probably have at least 10 kids in the next four or five years that are that are in in 500s now are going to be that I'm going to I'm in big trouble. I mean, a couple more years I'm going to have a hard time keeping up. I mean, there's a lot of really fast kids coming up. What did make Speedway so so popular in the 1980s? Well, one of the things there were late 70s and early 80s. There was so, it was a young man's sport. I mean, there was you you could, any given night there were 25 guys that could win the scratch main that night, you know, and, and none of them were 50 years old. <laughs> they, you know, it was all it was a, 28 was super old for for those days, and um, handicap racing was a big part of it. You know, learning to race and and going fast but not running guys over and, and passing and and not crashing, and I think that was a big part of it. You know, handicap in the 80s was huge. And when we all rode in the 80s and went to England, racing was easy. I mean, we could pass guys, and, and you know, if you miss a start, you could still catch them. And I think that's what the sport is missing now. We try and do it at our track as much as we can, but a lot of times we don't have enough riders to make a handicap program. But I think that's one of the most exciting things about Speedway to me, you know, is watching that guy from the 50 yard line in eight, six, or eight laps weeding through his way you know to win the main event that's that was it for me that's the guy i wanted to be from day one